All right, so this is a documentation of Meldesima, Amir for the real. Um, and I'm just gonna do a quick run through of the button test. Uh, I'm going to be testing this button, um, but being that we're in preview mode in Unity, um, I can't actually test that particular button, um, but it is connected to Alpha 2. So I'll be testing that. Um, and as you can see, I have a little loop, leap motion going on, so we're gonna do a little bit of that right now, um, just for the main menu, then I'll turn it off. Um, so when you touch that middle blinking light, you can make her disappear. I'll use my left hand, just because it's easier. And reappear. But uh, she'll actually be replaced with a two-dimensional figure, um, which is uh, something uh, something that I wanted to do initially, but um, I will get around to that <coughs> at a later date. So here we go. Um, so in order to play, um, that square button here exits the game, but we don't want to do that. Um, you would press this button. Um, but it is configured to alpha key 2 as well. Uh, I'll give you a little workaround here. So now Dasna in three dimensions. Okay, before I move on. I'm also going to turn this light off. So we can get a better view. And here we go. So I press 2. And it goes to this scene. Upon entering this scene, we go to caption one. We get a little steam when we press that button. A little puff of steam. Dialogue one. Caption three plus a dust storm. I'll just zoom in a little bit on that for you. There's some other particle effects in there as well. And press 2 again. We enter this state. Um, and there's actually some uh, lightning and showers um, that I've created. And as you can hear, there's a little bit of noise as well. And I've made tiny little, little puddles as well. You can see little puddles in there. Continue, we'll press 2, we get the dialogue, we'll press 2 once more, we'll get the caption. I think the caption's a little low, I'll have to fix that later. But that is where we are right now. I hope you enjoyed.